Welcome to Gundam Game Fest, your source for the latest information on Mobile Suit Gundam Series games. We'll be providing new information on the recently announced SD Gundam Battle Alliance and Gundam Evolution, as well as Mobile Suit Gundam Battle Operation 2. Let's get started. SD Gundam Battle Alliance. SD Gundam Battle Alliance was announced recently. Let's take a look at the latest trailer. G Universe, a place where many stories come together. That's where the break happens. That's where a new story is constructed. It's a distorted world. And the story begins. By you. SD Gundam Battle Alliance. New Gundam Action RPG game coming. Intervene in Gundam stories distorted by break phenomenon. Lead the distorted world into true history. Powerful visuals, dynamic motion, combo action. Hit combo with various weapons. Charge the SPA recast gauge and unleash your special attack. Each mobile suit has its own powerful special move. This is the new generation of SD Gundam action. Develop new unit with the capitals and blueprints you obtain in the field. Enhance your mobile suit to your liking by improving its performance and reinforcing it with expansion parts. A free platoon joint front that can be enjoyed up to three players. Form a platoon up to three players with friends or the computer. And go out to challenge a powerful enemy as a team. Relive Gundam Works. Complete distorted stories of break missions. Register true stories, true missions. To correct the altered stories and restore the authentic histories. And the mysterious mobile suit descending behind the break phenomenon. Gundam Latreia. What is the true meaning of those who create distorted history?
This new SD Gundam Action RPG features dynamic action gameplay with powerful visuals, the ability to acquire and customize new mobile suits, and a multiplayer mode where you can organize a platoon of three mobile suits to defeat powerful enemies. SD Gundam is a series of deformed mobile suits from the Mobile Suit Gundam series, delivering a different appeal from life-size mobile suits. In SD Gundam Battle Alliance, you can enjoy the distinctive visuals and actions of SD Gundam. The story is set in the G-Universe, a world where the stories of distorted Gundam titles unfold. You are pulled into the G-Universe by the phenomenon Historical Breaks. After you have conquered the Break Mission, which is a story where histories from different Gundam worlds are mixed by a Break Phenomenon, you will challenge the True Mission, where the story follows as it did in the past, to correct the distortions in the G-Universe. Alongside Special Sergeant Yuno Astarte, who is assigned to the same unit, and Sakura Slash, the navigator of G-Universe, you will fight in a joint front or battle alliance to correct the distorted story. What awaits at the end of distorted history? In the process of completing various missions, you can obtain blueprints, capital, and expansion parts that can be used to strengthen new mobile suits. So enhance your favorite mobile suits and use them to complete missions. With each mobile suit's own unique armor, anyone can easily create their own unique combos by hitting them with a series of blows. In addition, by attacking the enemy's back, weak points, or linking combos in the air, you can deal even more damage. Each unit also has special attacks. A special attack is a powerful action where players become invincible for a certain period of time and then unleash a flashy action. It takes time to charge to use the special attack, but by successfully hitting a combo, you will be able to shorten that time. Make full use of your own unique combos and special attacks to overwhelm the enemies. In addition, this game will feature cooperative multiplayer. When playing alone, you can select two NPC units as companions to join you on a mission. In multiplayer, up to three players can play the mission together. Mobile suits and characters from various Gundam titles will appear as units that can be set up as your companions. Enhance your favorite mobile suit along with your comrades in arms and run through the battlefield of G-Universe. SD Gundam Battle Alliance is set to be released on August 25th, 2022. For supported platforms, please check here. SD Gundam Battle Alliance features the most supported languages in a Gundam game ever. To all the Gundam fans around the world, please look forward to it. And pre-orders will begin rolling out starting today. Here are some of the pre-order benefits. For the first pre-order bonus, gain an early unlock of Night Gundam. All players can obtain the Night Gundam by progressing through the game, but those who pre-order can use the mobile suit from the beginning of the game. The second pre-order bonus is the extra set SD Sangoku Soketsude. This provides the Liu Bei Unicorn Gundam, Cao Cao Wing Gundam, and Sun Zhong Gundam Astray mobile suits. We will also have other special bonuses and limited editions. So please be sure to check our official website and social media for more information. SD Gundam Battle Alliance will be released on August 25th, 2022. Coming up next, Gundam Evolution. First,
Let's watch the trailer. Gundam Evolution is a hero shooter FPS based on the Gundam series. Exceed your limits with the high speed boost system and unleash powerful G maneuvers to claim victory. The console network test will take place in the US, Canada and Japan. Please see the detail here. After the Gundam Game Fest, a sign-up page will be open for the test regions. Please check the Gundam Evolution website for more information. Today, we'll introduce three game modes. Point Capture In Point Capture, players are divided into attacker and defender teams, then proceed to fight for control of the objective. Attackers aim to take control of the objective before the time limit expires, while the defender's mission is to protect them. When units from the attacker team get close enough to an objective, capture will start. Staying close to the objective will fill up the suppression meter. When the suppression meter is full, the objective will be captured. If a unit from the defender's team approaches the objective while the attacker's team is trying to capture it, the suppression meter will stop filling and the area will become contested. The team which has gained the most points by controlling the objectives wins the match. Domination In domination, teams fight to control three objectives that are unlocked randomly. Both teams aim to take control of the one objective which will randomly be unlocked at any given time. After a certain amount of time has elapsed, the objective to be captured will change. The team whose capture rate reaches 100% or whose capture rate is the highest when the time limit expires wins that round. The first team to win two rounds wins the match. Destruction In destruction, players are divided into attacker and defender teams that compete to destroy or defend objectives. Attackers will need to arm mega charges to destroy the objective. Attackers must get close to a mega charge to arm it. Once armed, the Mega Charge's activation rate will fill, with the objective being destroyed at 100%, or preventing attackers from arming the Mega Charge at all. Defenders aim to protect the objectives by disarming armed Mega Charges. The team which has gained the most points by destroying the objectives wins the match. Pilot your favorite mobile suits and seize victory. The console version of the network test will allow you to enjoy Gundam Evolution ahead of the launch. 
so we encourage everyone in the target regions to apply. In the network test, Gundam Exia and Marasai Unicorn version will be available in addition to the existing 12 mobile suits, just as in the recently held PC network test. In addition, you can use the Unit Customize function to customize the appearance of your units. Customize your units to your liking by using unit skins and weapon customizations obtained in-game, as well as various items such as emotes and stamps. Depending on the customization, it could be that mobile suit. Please check the Gundam Evolution website as we will begin accepting applications in the target regions after the Gundam Game Fest. The next title is Mobile Suit Gundam Battle Operation 2. Mobile Suit Gundam Battle Operation 2 is a maximum 6v6 team battle action game based on the Universal Century. New mobile suits are added every week and now there are approximately 300 different mobile suits available to play. Here is the new map that was added in the recent update. This map is set in a supply depot built in a desert area. It consists of a ground area where various facilities are being built and an underground area where supplies are stored. There are numerous loading docks connecting the ground and the basement, so it's effective to take advantage of these to launch a surprise attack. On the other hand, you will need to be careful as you can be hit by a surprise attack as well. All pilots should keep a close eye on their radar. The following are the mobile suits added in the same update. Delta Plus. The Delta Plus, a prototype transforming mobile suit that appeared in Mobile Suit Gundam Unicorn, is carrying on the legacy of the Project Zeta. Equipped with the highly adaptable beam rifle and beam saber, it is also equipped with a shield beam cannon and shield grenade launcher, making it a mobile suit that can respond to a variety of situations. Of course, it can also transform into Wave Rider form. The campaign is currently underway, so check it out. Additionally, here's a new mobile suit coming soon. Shatria. This is another mobile suit that appeared in Mobile Suit Gundam Unicorn. The Kshatriya, a mobile suit dedicated to the new type, was put into practice by the Neo Zeon remnants, known as the Sleeves. Equipped with powerful firearms, such as the Chest Mega Particle Cannon and Binder Mega Particle Cannon, and all range attacks with funnels are possible. It is also equipped with four binders that boast strong defensive performance. This Kshatriya, which boasts overwhelming offensive and defensive capabilities, will be available soon, so please look forward to it. That's all the information we have to present here. Don't miss out on the evolving GBO2. For more information, please visit the official GBO2 website. And finally, here are some new titles. Please check the trailer. Every Gundam story on your smartphone. While enjoying a story inspired by the original Gundam works, players create their own troops beyond the original story. G Generation Series. The latest in the series is now available as a smartphone tactical RPG. Relive the original story with all Gundam works. This title allows users to relive the Gundam original stories with the powerful and dynamic battle scenes. Mobile suits and pilots from numerous Gundam works, including TV anime, movies, games, manga, and novels, will also appear as playable units. The latest in the G Generation series. SD Gundam G Generation Eternal. The official website and Twitter are open to the public starting today, so please take a look and wait for further information. Today, we've provided an update on four Mobile Suit Gundam series games. 
We will continue to announce the latest information on our official website and social media. So please check back. Thank you for watching.